Use addition to check subtraction. Grade 1. Why can you use addition to check subtraction? You subtract one part from the whole. The difference is the other part. When you add these parts, you get the same whole. Let's look at an example. 15 minus 7. Take a look at the model. We have 15 cubes, and we want to subtract 7 cubes. We are left with 8 cubes. 15 is our whole, and 7 and 8 are parts. Now let's check the subtraction using addition. Add the parts. We have 8 cubes, and we want to add 7 more cubes. Now we have 15 cubes. 15 equals 15, so our subtraction was correct. Let's try another example. 13 minus 8 equals 5. 13 is the whole, and 8 and 5 are parts. To check our subtraction, we use addition. We add the parts. 5 plus 8 equals 13. 13 equals 13, so our subtraction was correct. Let's try another example. 16 minus 9 equals 7. 16 is the whole, and 9 and 7 are parts. To check our subtraction, we add the parts. 7 plus 9 equals 16. 16 equals 16, so our subtraction was correct. Let's try another example. 14 minus 6 equals 8. 14 is the whole, and 6 and 8 are parts. To check our subtraction, we add the parts. 8 plus 6 equals 14. 14 equals 14, so our subtraction is correct. If you thought this video was helpful, please leave a like. For more videos like this, please subscribe.